Thousands of Zoroastrians, like you and I, continue to practice the beautiful ancient religion of Zoroastrianism to this very day, despite the challenges our ancestors have faced. The question then arises, how do we as Zoroastrians begin to have a better understanding of our faith and culture, and of our fellow Zoroastrians from around the world? How do we preserve our precious and unique identity in our traditional homelands while creating and strengthening it in the diaspora? The Gen Z and Beyond survey will provide some much needed answers to these questions. Hello, my name is Sarah Stewart and I'm the Sharpaji Palanji Senior Lecturer in Zoroastrianism and Co-Chair of the Institute with Professor Almut Hinzer. I'm delighted that this project has come to SOAS and would like to thank all those who've supported it despite the difficult times we're living through currently. The digital survey that we're going to launch on the 16th of August 2021 is the first of its kind insofar as it's global, completely anonymous and entirely online. Now I'd like to introduce my colleague, Dr. Nazneen Engineer, who's going to be our project manager and we hope very much that you will add your voice to participating in the survey. Thank you, Sarah. I'm honoured to be a part of this historic project. Over the last few weeks, I have been interviewing Zoroastrians from around the world to find out what they think about the importance of this survey. I think this survey fulfills a need that exists in the community for decades now. And therefore, I'm hoping that through this survey, we get a better understanding of what the pulse of the community is. It is a documented, well-structured and scientifically done survey, which will then help community leaders in whichever part of the world to take information from the survey and then make decisions for their own community based on what their local community wanted. I think this survey is a brilliant initiative and really gives a global snapshot of what our current community looks like. We have such fantastic minds. We must use the exuberance of the youth, the wisdom and grace of the elderly and combine those two thought processes, not only just to survive, but to thrive and flourish. Hamazuri is very important for our community. During more than uh, 3,000 years, we have preserved our community by this important concept. It is uh, our duty to question, to search, and to argue about everything. This is the teaching of our Prophet. Participate in this research project so that our knowledge about our community becomes enhanced and elevated. The beauty about the survey is that first thing it's anonymous so you don't have to worry about what are my friends going to think and it's very exciting to know that we're doing a survey which is multinational so we'll get to understand what other Zoroastrians in other countries are doing. They will be helping the future generations to understand where we were at this point in time and place, what was uh, the issues that concerned us, the issues that excited us and that would be a good uh, measure for them to take forward. So I think to the extent they want to really contribute to the survival of this religion, it would be good to participate and provide their inputs. To participate in the survey, first visit genzandbeyond.com and click sign up. You can sign up for the survey by providing either your email address or your mobile number. Once you click submit, you will receive a unique survey link within two working days via email or by text. We know you are busy, so after clicking on the link, you will be able to pause and return to the questionnaire at your convenience. Once you have completed the survey, your contact details will be permanently deleted from our records. We have to stop infighting. We need to take care of our bars and we need to do something for the poor, old Parsis. We need to take care of our Abhyaris, our We need the youngsters who are doing well in life to take active interest in religion. Our community has some very real challenges as we go you know, a few decades into the future. I mean, one, our numbers are dropping quite precipitously. Two, we're getting more and more globally diverse. Three, things like secularization and such do, of course, have an impact on the cohesiveness of this community. It is, in many ways, up to all of us to kind of make sure that this community sticks together and make sure that we, we continue the traditions, religion and culture that have been perpetuated for centuries in Iran, India, and elsewhere around the world. I believe there are always differences between the older generation and the younger generation, how they look at the religion. And it's important to see that 
especially our younger generation, how they view the religion, what is stopping them to participate in many of community events. When you're talking to other people about taking the survey, I think that that is a conversation in itself. And I think it will encourage people to also be quite um, introspective about their own identity. I would want my children and my grandchildren to know from the survey, what have we learned and be proud of their roots and be proud of the community that they are a part of. I think we have carved like a niche of just being really nice, kind-hearted souls and just look at the Tatas. There's the lovely woman Irani who's made our community so proud. I can go on and on. It is truly a privilege to be a part of one of the oldest religions still in existence. To be able to continue to practice the rituals and be given the opportunity to carry forth the traditions, I encourage all Zoroastrians to take part in this survey. Get involved and get your voices heard. I think you've won the lottery of life when you are a Zoroastrian. It's a joy, really, to help someone from our community, and I think that's how it should be. When we do come together, it's amazing what we can do. And I think it's vital that we find out how the community is ticking on. Therefore, it is really important that we get everybody from whichever part of the world to take this survey. It is for every Zoroastrian all over the world. It's important for all of us to take part in this survey. Maybe it won't benefit you, but your answers could benefit someone else. And it'll be a great way to bond within the community as well.